After a second day of heavy fighting, U.S. Marines were successfully able to drive North Korean forces out of Seoul. With an additional division arriving soon, hopes are high that we may finally see a return to peace and stability in the region. Why is one man spared while another taken? To this day, I couldn't give you an answer. But death comes for us all, eventually. When you lose over 6,000 men in four hours, it's easy for one death to become just another number. But all I knew was my best friend was gone, and that part of me wished I had been taken instead. The dead, when they've settled their debts, it's up to the living to pick up the tab. And so it is time to say farewell to Private William Robert Irons, a man I had the privilege and honor to have under my command. A life is only important in proportion to its impact on the lives of others. By this standard, Private Irons ranks among one of our very best. He leaves behind family, friends, fellow Marines, and a grateful nation. Okay, let's pay my respect. Oh, my arm, my arm, damn. I'm sorry, Mitchell. Will was one of our best. Look, we take care of our own. If you ever need an excuse me, Private Mitchell, I'm Jonathan Irons. I'm Will's father. Mr. Irons, I'm sorry for your loss, sir. I'm sure you are, Sergeant. Private Mitchell, you were Will's best friend. You both paid too high a price for your country. It was an unfortunate tragedy, sir. It was more than unfortunate, Sergeant. It was unnecessary. Son, I want to offer you a second chance. Mr. Irons, Mitchell's been discharged with his injuries. I'm aware of his injuries, Sergeant. At Atlas, we have prosthetics that are 20 years beyond anything the military could offer you. Will told me what kind of soldier you were. You deserve to fight for a military that's as effective as you are. Think about it. Don't let Will's death be in vain. Sergeant. Uh, wait. Okay. Everyone knows what to do this time. Get into position. Uh, rescue the president? What the fuck? Two on the terrace. Check that. Three. On you, Mitchell. Drop him. How can a president be here? This might be just a training mission.
I <laughs> shut the <up>, president. <laughs> oh, I got to do it again. That was funny. <laughs> We're an Atlas rescue force. Can you authenticate? Zulu Tango. Okay, please keep your head down and stay close. All right, son. Prophet, we have the package. It's moving to extract. We got Copy Botus. Atlas zero one. Egress to the north access road. Copy that. Let's get him out of here. This way. We're detecting drones on the back patio. Let them pass. <laughs> Sure. Okay, move. Okay. Prophet, we're approaching the north access road. What's our exfil status? Transport is coming in hot. ETA, one mic. We're gonna have to dig in until our ride gets here. Hold them off! Sloppy, Mitchell. You're a dead man. Reset! No excuse for equipment failure. Best weapon you have is the one between your ears. Use it. Resetting simulation. Yeah. Everyone return to your starting positions. <laughs> it was his arm, sir. I knew it was too early. That arm's worth more to me than this entire facility. How's my boy doing? He's a work in progress. Well, keep working. This is a great soldier. It's a sad day indeed when the military has no use for good men like you. Jump in. Thanks. I'll give you the oh. tour. Yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. That was real, really realistic. Nicely done. Joker, we're bringing Mitchell over to R and D. Get the sim prep for another run. You got it, boss. What you're seeing is advanced warfare. Atlas has the single largest standing military in the world, but we answer to no country. Unlike the government, we don't keep secrets of our capabilities. We don't sell policy, we sell power. We are a superpower for hire. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot of power. Ha! 
Power isn't just about the ability to destroy. Atlas has built infrastructures in places like Korea, Sierra Leone, Nigeria. We do in a few years what it takes governments decades to accomplish. In fact, the truth is, we're often more effective than the governments that hire us. As my <laughs> son found out the hard way. Things like this, you can just look around all the Mitchell. stuff that's happening. I know you're not in this for the money. You remind me a lot of Will in that way. Now go get that arm fixed. Wait, how are we going to do that? All right, over here. Two types of oh. Uh. Primary and secondary ability. Assault is equipped with boost jump as well as sonics for crowd control. The specialist XO you're wearing has a built-in shield in addition to overdrive capability. Technicians are waiting for you. Get that thing fixed up and meet me out here. Hello, Mitchell. Let's see what's going on with that arm. Please, step over here. Go ahead and place your arm on the table. Uh, is this even safe? I lost my arm, so how did I get it back? Okay. Oh. Just gonna run some diagnosis. Um. Try and move your arm for me, please. Making a small adjustment. Hang on. Okay. Again, please. I think I see the problem. One more time, please. Oh, holy shit. All right, you're good. But I recommend some trigger time to check the calibration. Okay. Let's head to the range. <laughs> He's got the assault axe. don't stand a chance. Okay. That's how normal it is to stick a needle in your arm and it's, it's three packs. It's weird. Ooh. Here again, Alona. Trying to prove something. Don't need to try. Still got first place. Huh. All right, kit out. The Rexo is equipped with overdrive. Use it if you need a tactical advantage. The overdrive battery burns up quick, so use it sparingly. Step up to the station when you're ready. Activating target training. Begin round one. <laughs> oh, that's friendly. Okay, sorry. Use overdrive. Nice, slow mo. Shit. Begin round two.
Use overdrive. Begin round three. Fuck you. Grenade range. You need some hands on with a variable grenades. Okay, so oh. Boss, we got the sim ready Dead to light. roll again. Copy. Mitchell and I will be there in a minute. All right. Grab some grenades and run the You're on the fucking ground, Scott Field. Variable grenades let you switch your grenade type on the fly, depending on the threat. Activate the console. Toss a threat grenade. Shoot through walls to hit those targets. Switch to EMPs to take out drones. Alt, Q, Flash, EMP, Threat, okay. Handy. Toss a smart grenade and aim at a target to guide it. Again for a real challenge. Activating grenade training. Need more grenades. I'm out of fucking grenades. Give me grenades. To learn this, damn. Training complete. Your score was good. Uh, decent. Yeah. Let's move. We're going to okay. run the simulator again. Demonstration beginning in five minutes in the atrium. Wow, that's a big building. Ooh. Is be watching. I'm leaving this time. Kit up. Yeah, you're coming. Choose your loadout. I will take this one. Joker, we're heading up. Switching the sim to assault mode this time. Copy that. We're ready to go. Preparing assault mode. Simulation starting in three, two, one, execute. Okay, my lead, my Here way. They come. Take them down. Use overdrive. Target in the open. Atlas zero one. We're tracking POTUS. Meet. 
Media room, south wing. All these new controls there. Okay, let's do this again. Save, POTUS. Mr. President, we're here to rescue you. Need your authentication code. Alpha, Zulu, Tango. Confirmed. Stay behind us. Let's move. Atlas 01, be advised. We are detecting a large QRF approaching your position. Copy that, Prophet. Rose! Use your EMP! I wonder if in real life they also have this. Like a private military company that just saves the president if needed. The hell would select M as shield button? What the fuck? I mean, who would decide that? Ready for some real work. Good job, son. Welcome to Atlas. 
Thank you.